Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about She's Real Fine, my 409. We've got a brand new 64 Chevy Impala SS409 convertible. Oh my gosh, I'll give you all the details. She's really a special one. We'll give you that in just a minute. Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today, we're gonna to talk about our latest acquisition. Absolutely one of those cars that just is uh, memories for me and I'm sure many of you out there in uh, the video world as well. A 1964 Chevy Impala SS 409 convertible. Oh my goodness, let me tell you all the details of this car, but you're gonna to wanna to watch this entire video from start to finish because we're gonna do a walk around, we're gonna do a startup, we're gonna give you lots more details of this truly outstanding example of probably one of the most famous cars that everyone knows that song from the Beach Boys, She's Real Fine, My 409, save those pennies and save those dimes because someday I'm gonna buy myself a 409. Beautiful 64 Impala, you're gonna to wanna to watch Watch this, like I said, video from start to finish. And if you do, you can click on the link in the description and it'll take you right to our website. It'll give you all the information. It'll give you the pricing of the car. It'll give you also the leads to all of our other inventory at our website. And our website is www.ellingsunmotorcars.com. So you can find close to 100 classic and collectible vehicles ranging from cars from the 1920s all the way up into the 1970s and beyond. But I mean, there's always gonna be something here that you're gonna find of interest if you're a collector car aficionado, which if you're watching this video, chances are you are. 1964, now the 409s, the first ones of course were 1961, 1964, they were still going strong. The muscle car race was still in high swing, just kind of going up that way because everyone was looking for this kind of stuff. And as a kid, I went to walk to elementary school and I can remember seeing in my friend's yard, his brother was racing at the drag strip and it had this little emblem right there. They made sure that if you had one of those emblems on your vehicle, you knew there was something serious under that hood. Well, this particular car, being it is a uh, convertible and a factory four-speed, has the 340 horse 409. Only a single four barrel, but more than enough horsepower to get this car going down the road in a really, really fast fashion, absolutely. Take a look at all the details under the hood because it is really, really spectacular. Now, they added one really special option besides power steering and things of that sort. It actually has factory air conditioning and factory air conditioning is absolutely a rarity in, in my world and convertibles because it costs anywhere, you know, close three, four hundred dollars extra. And everyone said, well, you got a convertible. Why do you need air? Well, you get a triple black car like this one because this is what this car came when it was original. That's the stuff that it had. But yes, you want to have those nice options. Options are always wonderful to have on these old cars. It just makes them that much more enjoyable because you have to admit, we're kind of spoiled with our new cars. Boy, in 1964, this thing was loaded. Someone really, really did a great job of uh, checking off the little boxes, if you will, in 1964 when they went to order this particular car. Now, it also has one other big improvement that wasn't even available in 1964. It does have the white wall radial tires. Now, that is gonna be one of the biggest improvements on any of these old cars for driving ability, comfort, ride down the road. They're just way better than those old biased tires that many of us were used to for many, many years. Now, it does have an upgraded, I guess, a, a period correct type aftermarket aluminum wheel with the little spinners, uh, something that, you know, looks very period correct, if you will. I guess that's kind of the way I look at it. It does not look out of place by any sense of the imagination. No, let's say this is one of those cars that is just, if you want one in your collection that really, really is gonna set yourself off from everybody else, this is probably gonna be one of them. Let's take a look at the inside on this car just because, because the SS's came with lots of extra stuff. Again, they made sure to let you know that it was a 409 out there. They got the SS emblems on the door panels. You got the Impala emblem there. 
the rear quarters of also will tell you that it is an SS. Now take a look at the inside. This thing is really, really nice with the, the black vinyl bucket seat interior center console with the four speed. Now that's really kind of a rarity in the uh, old convertible world so to say the least. Factory tack in the middle as it would it be. It's got something I don't think I've ever seen on a six. It's got tilt steering. I didn't even know that was an option in 1964, but obviously it was because there it is right there in place. And it has air conditioning, so you got the air conditioned dash. Everything in this interior is really, really nice. Now, it also has, of course, a power convertible top. A simple touch of a button and the convertible top goes up. In case you were not expecting rain and got caught, but you know, these cars, of course, didn't melt if they got wet. But if you're like me, once these cars get to this level, odds are you probably don't wash them very often. You kind of dry clean them with the polish and wax just to keep them because the underside in this car is also very, very solid very very nice car well I guess you know if you're like me you can find all this stuff on Facebook YouTube and Instagram as well give us a like leave us a comment or subscribe we appreciate it very much you have all the information on this car our current inventory and as an added bonus there's also information on cars we've sold in the past as well so if you have some time to peruse the internet and take a look at all the stuff take a look there really really neat Yes, the 409s come with dual exhaust and a four speed. I mean, it's got the SS trim, the special tail lights, of course, for an SS. I mean, everything about this stuff says luxury, class, and performance. So if you like me, the other thing I would like to do is I'd like to come down and look at it in person. Well, we're more than happy to have you come on down to Ellingson's. We're open Monday through Friday from 10 to 5, Saturdays 10 to 4 as well. So if you want to come down in person, get your hands on, take a look at it in, in person, we'd love to have you come down. Boy, this is a nice car. <laughs> My uncle had a new 63 that he brought up to grandma's back when I was a kid, and I got a ride in one of these things. Uh, that speedometer goes up to 120 miles an hour, and I think he did that with my promise not to tell my mom and dad because I could have gotten big trouble, or he could have gotten big trouble, but grandma was riding with me, and she liked to go fast. So if you're just looking for your first uh, performance car, your first collector car, boy, do we have a gem right here with all the bells and whistles. Be something you would cherish for many years, or maybe you need to add this one in your collection. Maybe it's one of a dozen or more, but you know what? This is a really special car. So we're glad you're watching our videos. We appreciate it and we thank you very much. And uh, we will see you next time at uh, ellingsonmotorcars.com.